Hello and welcome to Rhythm Doctor, the latest, I believe, game from the creators of A Dance and Fire and Ice, the game I've played recently with the the two orbs and you have to do all to the music and everything. Uh, this is a similar rhythm game, but I think it's about saving people's lives as a doctor, as the name would imply. Um, <laughs> yes, uh, this came up, the uh, photosensitivity warning, so if you are so affected, probably best give this one a miss. Um, just for safety's sake. Um, right. Let's go. Okay. It's early access, we get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel people have become kind of oversensitive to the early access thing. Are people that... narky about it? It's like, oh, the game doesn't work. But it's like, yeah, it was early access. Obviously. Whatever. <laughs> I'm not going to go on a big rant before we even get to the game. Uh, right, story mode, I suppose. Who slots? Very retro. What the hell am I talking about? A lot of games have slots. It's just named differently. Ian. Oh, y you're here. Thanks for joining Rhythm Doctor. A remote defi... Oh, I can't say this word. Defibrillation. Yay, internship program. I'd have liked to do this in person, but everyone's working from home these days. How true. Anyways, before we begin, we need to know something important. Treating patients with rhythm doctor is ideally done by slamming the space bar. This is so that you can hear the space bar's clack. And use your ears to tell you when the sound of your space bar is perfectly in time with the beat. You might be in a situation where you cannot slam your space bar. In that case, you can tap lightly to the beat instead. Do you prefer to slam it or tap it? Um... Let's slam it. Okay, r remember the slam spacebar when playing Rhythm Doctor. Now to make sure the sound is synced. Oh, we could have skipped some of this. Five hours later. Okay, you're all set up. You know, you're our first remote intern. We could really use the help. I actually uh, started up a game because the calibration took so long. It's a rank match, so I can't quit out right now. I'm almost done. So relatable. Your first patient's over there. Dr. Page can help you out. Hello, Dr. Page. Ian, this was your job. So sorry. All right, you. Behind your computer. Hi. Our shift is really busy right now, so let's get get right to it. We treat patients suffering from different chest pains and heart conditions. You treat patients by pressing your spacebar on the seventh beat. Got it? Listen to the music, and only on the seventh beat. Here we go. E, four, seven, six, five, six, seven, eight. E, four, seven, six, five, six, seven, eight. Nice. Okay, I, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I should really give these people ca like voices, shouldn't I? <laughs> Looks like we're ready to move on. <laughs> I lost my match though. We've got a lot of patience to treat, so let's get started. Treating a Shogun warrior.
Oh no! Ah! Wow, okay. <laughs> oh, I did badly that oh D. <laughs> D for dickhead. Samurai says this is a terrible form of alternative medicine. Yeah, with me as your doctor, definitely. Yeah, I completely messed that up. Oh. Oh, it looks. Okay, I have to do them again, I think. Okay. Pure focus. Here we go. Ninja reflexes. Yes. A plus. Yay! <laughs> I am the maestro. Nice one. He did it. Whoa! It really works. By the way, this is going to be another one of those games where I don't say shit because I'm too busy concentrating. I'll try my best. It'll be a huge help in getting to all these people. It's been crazy around here. Good job. Not a bad sense of rhythm either. That will be perfect. Let's move on. We've got a new patient in here today, an adolescent. You can help him the same way. Be sure to check your pager for some basic patient info I jotted down when they were admitted. Alright, let's go. One to two, intimate. I don't know if I want to get intimate with a teenager, but hey. <laughs> Patient experiencing sudden heart strain. He seems to have something weighing on his mind. Hey, before we move on, some tips about a new type of heartbeat. Oh, God. <laughs> have I not suffered enough? This time, you'll get a new kind of patient. Sometimes people come to us with this problem. Their heart skips a beat, so let's catch it while they're still in reach. When you see a red X in the line, that beat will be silent. Just count the numbers in your head. Oh no! And hit on the seventh beat. Nice, good job. The next patient isn't even actually sick. I think he's just suffering from excessive schimalitia. Hopefully you can snap him out of it. Well, good luck. Cool. Now watch me fail. Doctor, you've got to help me. My heart's not feeling too good. I don't know what to do.
music from this is really chill. <laughs> now the patient is insisting on being treated, I'll handle the new one. What the hell? At the same time? What were? She's here too. Looks like Miss Piggy. turn into a plant monster. This is kind of adorable. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Oh no! <laughs> Come on, bro! Oh. A budding romance. A plus. Yay! <laughs> We make a good team, huh? I say the music's just really chill. I'm <laughs> it's just, it's lovely. Great job, intern. Whoa! Oh, I forget the voices I do. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, uh, hey, uh, Haley. I had no idea you were here too. Kirby. <laughs> yeah. Well, funny story. You said something about having to go to the hospital, and then you never texted back to explain why. I kind of started freaking out, thinking you got sick. I got so worried, my chest started to hurt. So my parents had to come here too. Aww. I didn't think it'd be so musical though. <laughs> we're, we're experimenting with some new methods. When I heard that you were on this floor too, I wanted to come visit. Oh, cool. Um, sorry, that last time we talked, I got flustered. I think I did something stupid. What I meant was... No, don't worry about it. At least we have plenty of time to hang out while we're stuck here. You can tell me whatever was really on your mind, okay? Alright, that's probably enough for now. Let's get Logan his rest. Ready in turn, let's continue the tour. <laughs> that was lovely. So, we haven't explained the whole musical doctoring process yet. We kind of pulled you straight into the deep end. Sorry about that. Thankfully, you're a quick learner. Ian, do you think you could explain the programme? It's more your thing. <laughs> right. The Rhythm Doctor programme is a new experimental healthcare initiative. It's a music-based cardio cardiological treat. Yeah, sure. <laughs> By listening to the patient's heartbeat and synchronising with it, we can calm the irregularities. It's quick and can save a lot of lives. Plus, interns can perform the treatment remotely. Shorter waiting times and less work piled on the staff. It's a win-win situation. That's the idea, at least. As long as all goes well, we can... Who's this creepy bastard? <laughs> Idega. Ian, did you finish setting up that remote connection? <laughs> yes, sir. As you can see, our new intern is here and... Very good. Let's not be overconfident. There's still a lot that both of you should be getting to. The shift has only just started. Ensure that every patient is personally seen to. I imagine I'm not interrupting some sort of break. Not at all. We would just submit a report about the program by the end of the day. <laughs> Don't mind him. That's our world. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Personal robot, I imagine. We should shoot... <laughs> We should show you around so you can meet the rest of the patients. You should be able to shift your video display around the hospital to... Oh, hold on, something's happening. I didn't expect this to be so story rich. <laughs> One of our patients needs help immediately. That can be good. You're up in turn. Remember, just stay calm and keep counting to seven. No matter what happens. Oh, this is a boss, by the look of it. Sword-wielding patient has a chronic tiredness for the past seven years. No medicines have been effective. R rhythmic thingy advised. Defibrillation. Defibrillation. Defribble wibble. Oh, no. 
boss stage. <laughs> oh no! Okay. Oh, I see. I have to hit it even if he doesn't play it. <laughs> so, so something's messing with the connection. Could it be... Could it be what? Don't keep it in the dark. Hold space to skip. Yep, it was the infection. A classic case of the Wi-Fi signal jamming virus. Connectifia abortus. Oh, we're in the Matrix now, are we? About to come back now and stronger. I oh, know. What? His bloody head fell off. What the hell? <laughs> I thought I was doing all right there. I thought I had it had it down. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I was ignoring all that. <laughs> Annoying. Yeah, well, I will not be beaten. All right. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's get into it. All right, Ian, we've had enough from you. Come on. Yes! Oh, I was in a complete trance there. <laughs> Is it? 
I'm not taking my finger away, just in case. Act one complete! Yeah, baby! Phew, great work. Um, right, I'm going to end this here. <laughs> oh, that was good. Um, I might might do a bit more of this. I, did, I say honestly didn't realize, I knew it had a story and stuff, which the last one obviously didn't. But it seems quite interesting and involved. Um, <laughs> more dialogue than I expected. Um, but yeah, no, it was good. Uh, I'll link it in the description. Have it a go yourself. <laughs> right, yo. Uh, leave a like if you liked it. Don't leave a like if you didn't. Subscribe, ring the bell and all that stuff. And I shall see you in the next video. Ciao for now. <laughs> Cheers.